Next at six, state agencies are only meeting some 70% of goals set out for them this year. That is according to a website created by the governor to show the public how they're doing. Only News 3 political reporter Jessica Arp looks at how they're meeting their goals. Jess? Well, the goals for these state agencies are largely of their own making, and they're posted for the public to see on a state website. We took a look at what agencies are and aren't meeting and asked the governor if the performance was good enough. In an executive order back in March, Governor Scott Walker ordered state agencies to create performance dashboards, a way to create transparency in state government. What resulted was performance.wi.gov, a website to track metrics for all 17 state agencies in Wisconsin. The risk, that, and we talked about this at the time, the risk of putting it out on the website is exactly that question as people including not to say you but detractors say aha look you haven't done that a review of the information on the site some of which is recent others from summer shows only 70 percent of targets are being met for us we have really really high goals if we set low goals we hit them all the time even if we set mediocre goals we hit them all the time but we set high goals. Some of those missing the mark include the Wisconsin Economic Development Corporation, the state's job creation agency, which is only hitting two of seven of their created metrics, not meeting goals for the number of businesses served and loan default rates. The Department of Children and Families is hitting only half their marks, not meeting a goal for timely contacts on child maltreatment, increasing child support payments, and some child placement rates in Milwaukee. Clearly, uh, we're not doing a very good job uh, as a state as a whole. Um, these metrics are just one measure of so many. I mean, at Lincoln Hills, we know that we're not making kids safe, frankly which is a far bigger concern than even the metrics that they have highlighted. The governor says this is all a work in progress and that he is discussing these issues with cabinet secretaries. If we were at 100 percent on everything, I wouldn't have much of a compelling case to, to even think about running for re-election. But if we're constantly trying to make things better and, and aim higher, uh, those are things that, that in addition to some of those reforms we'll get from the federal government that would make me inclined to want to run again. Now, there are some agency goals that are listed as in progress on this site. Even when those are factored in, still a quarter of goals are being missed. A spokesman for WEDC called the measure for their agency a progress report and that said that some of the measures are cyclical. A DCF spokesman said they set goals that are difficult to obtain and that most measures are, quote, trending in a positive direction. We'll have links to this site so you can see these metrics for yourself on channel3000.com. Jessica Arp reporting from our news center tonight. Thank you, Jessica.